Hi all, this is Mark Schmidt with the Cloud Platforms Business Unit at Red Hat. Today we'll be looking at installing OpenShift 4.2 on Red Hat OpenStack 13. First thing we'll need to do is prepare the OpenStack over cloud. Uh, that involves creating an external network, as well as a subnet, and floating IP. Next we'll create a flavor. Now we'll download CoreOS and create an image. Next we'll create a project as well as users and roles. Now I'll quickly check that authentication is working. And now I'll check the project quotas and set those accordingly. I'll now download the OpenStack installer. Now we'll create some install config files starting with the clouds.yaml config that identifies the authentication parameters. Now we'll generate the install-config.yaml using the installer. This is where you'll provide your SSH public key, the platform, uh, the floating IP, the flavor, the domain you'll be using, as well as the cluster name and the pull secret from the download page. And for an ease of demonstration, we'll configure an internal DNS. Now we can kick off the installer with the install-config.yaml that was generated. By default, it will deploy three masters and three worker nodes. If you need to change this, you can modify the install.config.yaml to specify the number of workers that you want deployed. The deployment process takes between 30 and 40 minutes, but we've sped it up for sake of brevity. While the deployment is going on, you can download the OC client, which will give you the ability to run all of the uh, OC commands. Now that the cluster is deployed, we can explore the cluster and check the cluster health. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to try this yourself, give it a shot at try.openshift.com.